Hey everyone, this is Andrew Tai and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to run Five Nights at Freddy's Security Breach using DirectX 11. So by default, this is a DirectX 12 game. However, if you have a video card that doesn't support DirectX 12 or an operating system that does not support DirectX 12, then you can actually force this to run in DirectX 11. So the way to do this through Steam is you right click on the game in your library and then you go to properties and then we go to general and then we can type in this launch option here, which is dash force space dash D3D11. So when you press play on this game, then this will launch in DirectX 11 instead of DirectX 12. The other way to do this is that you can change the shortcut options. So you can right click on here, go to properties, then we can go to local files, click on browse, and then we can make a shortcut. So I'm gonna just show you how to make this shortcut from scratch. What you do is you find the FNAF9 EXE file, and then you right click on it and then show more options. And then you can go ahead and create a shortcut. In the shortcut here, we're gonna to go to properties and right click on that. And then basically in the target, what we need to do is press space. Then we'll type in the same command, force, and then space D3D11 and press okay. So when we double click on the shortcut, that's gonna launch in DirectX 11. Anyway, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like and subscribe. I have lots of other game setup tutorials on my channel. Please check it out. Please like, please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.